Who was the first person to reach the Americas? It was the Native Americans, done. Okay, so this question is normally asked by egocentric Europeans. So who was the first European to reach the Americas? In 1492, Columbus sailed the ocean. Okay, so I think it's steadily becoming common knowledge that Christopher Columbus was not the first European to reach the Americas. Who was? The Vikings. After plundering their way through Europe, some Vikings set sail for the Americas. Evidence of Viking settlements have been found in Lonsel Meadow in Newfoundland, Canada. But were the Vikings really the first Europeans to set foot on the continents? It is possible that it was actually the Irish. Some historians believe that an Irish monk named St. Brendan was actually the first European to reach the Americas arriving some 400 years before the Vikings. According to an account written by St. Brendan, he sought out the Promised Land, and after seven years he is said to have found it. The Promised Land in this case is believed to be North America. Once there, St. Brendan and his companions explored the continent, apparently walking for 40 days to find they were no closer to the end. While this can't be proven, there is some evidence to give the story some legitimacy. First there is St. Brendan's writings in which he describes his journey. However, the early surviving copy dates from the 9th century, some 300 years after St. Brendan's supposed voyage, and much of it comes across more like fiction than fact. For example, in one passage, he describes giving communion on the back of a wheel. In the 1980s, a marine biologist named Barry Fell found rock carvings in West Virginia which resembled an ancient form of Irish writing. He attempted to translate it and believed it told the story of the nativity. However, many scholars have criticized his interpretation of these carvings. The boat St. Brendan is believed to use as a kirk small open vessel made of a wooden frame which is covered in ox hide and waterproof with tar. It was believed that no one could make a trip to the Americas in such a boat until 1976 when Tim Severin built his own and set sail. Sailing from Ireland to the Faroe Islands, the Iceland to Greenland, eventually landing in Newfoundland. Finally, the last piece of evidence comes from the Vikings themselves. In their sagas, they mentioned that Native Americans were already familiar with Europeans, and one tribe even spoke a language which was similar to Irish. So it could be that the connection between Europe and the Americas goes back further than we thought. Although, St. Brendan did mention he only made the trip after St. Barra told him how he visited Paradise first. So maybe he was the first instead?